What is my task? It shall be. party before venturing forth. Oh, so you come to us at last, child of Baal. You come to claim your heritage, perhaps, and in pieces, no less. How terrible it must be to die in such a state. at long last. Oh, I can only hope. I am most grateful to you then for my release. Oh, may the heavens sing your praises for this charity you have shown me. What is my task? I will do my best. You must gather your party before venturing yes. forth. Gather your party before venturing forth. Very well. So we meet again. How fitting that our reunion should be in this place of retribution. It is I, or an echo perhaps. My essence joined that of our dead father after you murdered me after all. But in the end, all the children of Baal end up here. I have one of the tears of Baal you I will not hand it over to you, however. You do not deserve it. I mean you are a pathetic worm 
sniveling little cretin. I relished spitting Gorion on my blade. And were there true justice, our positions would be reversed now. Ah, yes. Stoke that infernal wrath of yours. I can feel the anger within you, boiling like a pit of sulfur in the crevices of your heart. Feel it, do you not? The taint that surrounds your soul like a serpent, squeezing it, spreading its venom. That taint, that wrath exists in all the children of Baal, but few know how to use it. You have become the slayer, have you not? The avatar of our dead father. The blackest expression of murder. I see it behind your eyes. Summon your wrath for me, if you can. You are the one who brought me here. Your power over this place has summoned forth my essence once again. And why do you think you have done that? I can teach you how to use your wrath. You can control the taint, direct it, summon it at will. You can become the slayer at will and become the weapon of murder that you were meant to be. So think of me. Think of how I destroyed your precious Gorion. How I plundered the lives of your Candlekeep. Summon your rage. Stir the depths of your black heart. Summon wrath. Summon wrath and become it. Because if you cannot, then you are not worth your destiny. It should have been I. It should have been I. Attack me, worm, if you dare. Then you were never worthy of Bald's blood, and I shall crush you where you stand. To Shall be. What is my task? Consider it done. You must gather your party before venturing. It is a good thing you've come to me, child of Bull. Only you hold the power to vanquish the terrible creature that holds one of your dead father's tears here. I have heard of your prowess, child. Most impressive for a mortal life. Creatures of great power thrown aside as if they were nothing. Beings any other mortal would quake before, you have fought against valiantly. You are a wonder of destruction, child of all. Go then, and defeat the creature that lies in the cavern. Crush it beneath your heel and claim another victory! It is a powerful creature, child of Bor. One that only you can destroy. I am confident in your ability to deal death to such a creature as this, and take the tear. That is, it is a creature that deserves death, child of Bor. You are such a wondrous fighter. I simply thought that you could defeat it where others failed. Because... because it exists, it stands in your way! You do not? Then perhaps you consider carefully the place that your terrible power will focus upon? Consider the reason behind every blow? I see that despite your great deeds, you have no pride in your child of war. So be it. Humility serves well those who wield it well. I await your word. On my... I will do my you best. Must gather your party before venturing forth. Yes. Yes?
on my own. Very well. You must gather your party before venturing. The tear of Baal lies very close to here, child of Baal. Just beyond either of these two rooms before you. You have encountered many times in your existence where you have been forced to swallow your fear, no? You have fought off terror that would overwhelm a lesser being and shown courage instead. Pass through either of these rooms and your vaunted courage shall be challenged, child of Baal. I have something I will offer, however, which will make it so much easier for you, child. You know, like so many with power, that items of magic can do much that the ordinary man cannot. Such as this cloak, for instance. Stitched together from the flayed skins of lovely nymphs. Wear it and be soothed by its powerful magic. Panic will never overcome you again. With this cloak, you could easily gather the tear of Baal and worry not of your courage. I bow to the power of your divine soul, child and offer this cloak up to you, if you wish it. Of course, I shall remain to give you the cloak of skins, should you desire it. Unless you acquire the tear on your own, of course. I am only here to offer my help. I'll help however I can. Happy to help! To try to help anyway. What can I do? Done. What is my task? As you ask. On my honor. It shall be. What is my task? On my honor. Consider it done. Yes, I will do my best. What is my task? <laughs> On my honor. Yes, what is my task? On my honor. Yes. <laughs> Yes, it shall be. This is a lot more exciting than any circus. I am ready. You need something? Consider it done. On my honor, I will do my best. Yes? Yes. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Very well. Ah, so the child of Baal comes to me finally, for the last of the tears of Baal. 
You have come very near to locating your quarry. Oh yes, indeed you have. Choices on the journey that was your life. Many paths have you taken, and always they have had an effect on those around you, even when that was not your intention. Such is the fate of those born with destiny. The consequences of the actions they take ripple about them throughout all that is reality. Perhaps the fate of others concerns you little. Perhaps it consumes your soul. That too is a choice, an action taken, a ripple set into the pond of reality. The path that you take to the tear will affect another this day. Another who is innocent of the action you take, and yet affected by it just the same. One of those who travels with you who orbits your destiny and yet is innocent of your taint, will do nicely. Remember, child of Ball, a choice must be made, and you must live with the consequences of that choice. <laughs> it shall be. from one who willingly shoulders the burden of destiny and its effect upon others. Your companion is returned to you, child of Baal. The tear of Baal is yours, child. Yes? What is my task? Consider it done. On my honor, I will do my best. Yes? Yes. You Where Minsk goes, What's gonna be evil way? stands aside. What is my task? Very well. On my honor, done. You must gather your party before venturing forth. As you ask. Yes? What is my task? It shall be. So we are to battle one last time. No more hiding for either of us.
I came to hell to help my friend. Who helped you, Irenicus? Demons? You were going to die alone in hell, and you know it. No more platitudes, Irenicus. You have taken much from all of us. Now you die your final death. I grow tired of shouting battle cries when fighting this mage. Boo will finish his eyeballs once and for all, so he does not rise again. Evil, meet my sword. Sword, meet evil! My consider it done. Yes? What is my task? I will do my best. You need something? Manus. Every husband has his day. Yes? Yes. What is my very well? On my honor. Yes? Done. Come 
us. What can I... Brother, I will see you soon. I'm ready. you who have survived the return of the exile to Soldan SLR know me, your queen. But only some of you know the hero beside me, who was most instrumental in saving our city and the Tree of Life. Such selfless acts almost resulted in the loss of your life, and perhaps much more than that. These deeds were not performed alone. Seldon SLR also extends its gratitude to those who have traveled with you and fought by your side to help save our city. There is no reward adequate enough for one who has done so much. Let us offer them the eternal thanks of our people and an amulet of the Seldarine to remind you forever that you are welcome here amongst us. As for the man whom we once knew as John Aleth, I can only say that he died long ago. He lives in my memory still. To the man he became, the exile Erenicus, he who performed atrocities on you, the tree, and his former people, to him I can only send my prayer that he finds the peace in death he never found in life. I feel I must apologize on his behalf for what he put you and your friends through. For his madness, we stripped Jonaleth of his elven immortality and exiled him to create Irenicus instead. I cannot help but feel we are partly responsible. It is something I shall have to ponder on. As for you, I imagine you are eager to resume your travels once again. We wish you well. No, we look forward to your return in the future, should you desire to.
to end like this. Orion's sword has become too powerful. We should have acted long before now. There is no reason to be concerned. The fate of this fool has been sealed. But can we be so sure? This spawn of Baal is doomed. There is no escape.